He's fine. Just unconscious. I don't think he saw me. He probably has no idea what happened to him. He had it coming. So you came. I've been waiting for you. You're here to hear the rest, right? Have been stabbed in the heart by this young man and died. Yes. Although, that reminds me, I haven't thanked you yet. Thank you very much. I very much appreciate you saving me. Hold on. How do you know about being stabbed by Dio? Are you an Esper too? Yes. Indeed I am. I am able to jump through time, just like you. Because I had to. Think back. Why are you here? If I hadn't been killed by Dio, no one else would have been murdered. Consequently, your own abilities would never have manifested. I did explain, didn't I? The purpose of the A-B project was to send the two of you to the past. Or your minds, at least. In order for that to happen, some death was necessary. When a human brain is faced with danger, its processing speed increases. Information is processed more quickly, and time almost seems to slow. A few seconds can feel like an eternity. Unfortunately, that in itself isn't enough to send oneself through time. The amplitude of the consciousness is simply too small. In order to increase the amplitude, we need to slow down the brain before the increase happens. It's a little like a slingshot. You pull back on the rubber band and then let go. The potential energy you stored in the band is released and converted into kinetic energy. That's what fires the bullet out of the slingshot. Now, while a slingshot can only fire in one direction, your mind isn't similarly limited. When the bullet of your consciousness is fired from the slingshot of your brain, it travels past the three-dimensional world and into the four-dimensional one. From that perspective, time is no longer fixed. In other words, you can travel to the future, the past, whenever you like. Your consciousness has been released from the three-dimensional cage. In order for that to happen, I had to infect you with Radical Six. We're infected with Radical Six? Yes. Don't you remember, Sigma? Luna should have told you about it in another timeline. people with such a horrible disease? Every single one of you has been infected. 